welcome to Black Bamboo, yeah. Welcome, welcome to Black Bamboo, y'all. Welcome, welcome to Blog Ripper 2019. So that's a tip there. Be spontaneous. <laughs> she didn't know I was going to do that. No. I had no clue that's where Ooh, I was going. All right. <laughs> so we're going to reach into our bag and get a tip. Stay we spontaneous. Can share it's true. With you. File management tips. Oh, yeah. Ooh, that's a good one. Okay, so. <laughs> what are you talking about? Still have not where? figured it Bring out. Up. Right, um, back up. What are we talking about? File management, meaning what? Paper files. And what that too. What are, so what are we talking about? Well, no, well, computer that's... files. Okay, computer files. Because if you're doing what we're doing, if you're doing podcasts, if you're doing videos, if you're doing songs, right? You need to keep track of your of your um, files because you need to be able to get them when you need to use them. When you need to distribute them. When you need to. I know for me, I keep links. I got. Photos, I you know, so I have all these different pieces right. that go together for videos or for whatever else, right. and they need to. There are a lot of things that I have that I cannot find from before I was concerned with Bob knowing how to manage yeah. files. I, and that's now always... I have come up with systems, yeah, where at least I keep all video files under something called video mm -hmm. on a drive that I go to, and then I've labeled like like for the files for this, I'll dump them into a folder. With the date, with the purpose, you know, with Gab and Jam, label, with episode, whatever the name of the episode, so that when it's time to actually edit, I know where, what it is that I have on the file. Because after a while, all of these files look alike. Yeah. And we're at the point where we're at, at three, ter uh, three, four, or five terabyte external hard drives full of stuff. Yeah. So if I don't know where to go find it or, or when I'm searching... I'm, I'm screwed. Yeah, well, I always keep myself in multiple places. So, and and I've just for the longest, like with songs and stuff, they've just always been grouped together. So, okay, so what do you mean? Kinda, you know, meaning that by projects. And okay, okay, so you name stuff. them. Yeah. Another project, okay. So the project, and then everything for that project goes in a particular file. Okay, and that makes sense. But again, that's, it's, it, I, had to, I have to think ahead of time because mm -hmm. I used to just do. And then, like, oh, I'll be able to figure it out. And I, I'm, oh. I'm telling you, there are tons. It's like a well, I, as, as, For me, I just got way too much stuff. So, I, I, you know, it's always been that way. It's like it's, it's just always been way too many things, especially once once I moved from tape mm -hmm. to computers. Mm -hmm. It became difficult because on now that we're on computers, like what you say, it's mm -hmm. like on so tape, records, right, because okay. on tape, I would work on one song at a time. Right. Mm -hmm. You know, it's like, you might have an idea for other songs, mm -hmm. and I'll capture that idea someplace, mm -hmm. but I'm, I'm concentrating on whatever song is... Up on the mixer at the time, because right. you couldn't even save mixes right. at one time. Right, you can't save a mix, right. you, you got that, so, right. so, so you're working on one yeah. song at a time. Which is, I think, for the earlier stuff is why I was not a perfectionist with that stuff, mm -hmm. because I was eager to move on to the next song. Right. Um, whereas now I have songs in so many different spots mm -hmm. and so many different states of completion, <laughs> um, and which, so, so I'm working on, you know, several projects at one time. Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm. so, and that's, that's kind of the way that I'm working today. Mm -hmm. Yes. But that be, becomes very, um, it becomes very important to kind of know where these yes. things are. You know, yes. So, so, so that's why you know I try to make sure that you know. So I even have, when you have like your your like the song idea, the clips, or what do you call the folder that you keep those in? So those just kind of go in my big logic folder. And okay. So, so all that stuff is okay. together with. It's not under logic. rough takes or anything. No, it's not. It's not there. So okay. um, it's sort of like once the song becomes named. Okay. And then I start, um, and once I start kind of tweaking a song, okay. that's when I start naming a song by the date and the time I and all this and time. So which you I'm can working see which uh, incarnation you're working on. Yeah, so I know okay. which version of the song that I'm working on. I know that this is the song being completed. Okay. Um, as opposed to 
you know, when they're not completed. So and then you'll and then, put final sometimes at the end of yeah, the title. Yeah, and then I'll okay. put final at the end of it. Okay. So, so I'll know that that's, that, was, that was the final version okay. that I ended up with. So Yeah, so, woo. All right, file management, that's a big one. Um, yeah. If you have any tips, because again, this is a work in progress, but I've, you know, I've had to take on things that, that I never considered before to be able to do what we do without a whole lot of muss and fuss. So, yeah. but if you have tips that we have not shared, please feel free to drop them in the comments below. We'd love to hear from you. Um, if you dig the vibe, make sure you subscribe. <laughs> I was late. <laughs> We're really wishing you your file uh, is taking a while to load. We're wishing you love, peace, and chicken grease. Yay.